on dragging the ground. Go ahead. Anna, you're clear to come on board. I'll be clear to come on board, and thanks for your patience with the comm. We are in an orientation that's creating some blockage. The receiver call on dragging the ground. Yeah, we figured that was it. Uh, uh, no problem. That's part of the deal. Chris Cassidy giving a wave. Eagerly await, awaiting uh, Bob and Doug to come aboard. Just behind him, you see Anatoly Ivanishin and Ivan Wagner, Russian cosmonauts of, of uh, Expedition 63, standing by. We'll be able to come aboard Dragon here in a sec, get some views from the uh, crew Dragon. We're in a short handover of uh, those uh, communications from the International Space Station video and audio. Should be regaining them uh, momentarily. Anatoly Ivanishin in the foreground there. Chris Cassidy continuing the prep work for opening up the hatch there. Again, uh, the pressurized mating adapter hatch you see there in the foreground is open. The A-pass hatch to the uh, international docking adapter is open. Just one more, and that's the hatch of Dragon, the Crew Dragon vehicle.
This is Mission Control Houston. We're continuing to equalize the pressure of that last hatch. Behind that hatch is Bob Bankin and Doug Hurley aboard the Crew Dragon spacecraft. We are moments away from opening the hatch and welcoming them aboard the International Space Station. Houston, if you're just tuning in, we are standing by for confirmation of the hatch opening between the International Space Station and the Crew Dragon. There's the hatch to the crew dragon. Seeing Doug Hurley through the glass on the other side. And there's Bob Bankin.
equalizing that pressure between a crew dragon and an international space station just moments away. Yeah. 